Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. As you guys know, well, maybe some of you know, I spend about eight to 10 hours a day on my feet. A bike company reached out to me and said, hey, we know you spend too much time on your feet. How about something to get you going once in a while and we'll send it to you. And I'm like, all right, stay tuned. All right, good morning to everybody out there. Feeling pretty good. Weather is good. Tennis is okay. <laughs> My legs are okay, I guess, for now. Um, thank you to Coffee Sponsor of the Day. At, and it's at Daniel Kang underscore. At Daniel Kang underscore. Who is now a Buy Me a Coffee member. Thank you, uh, Daniel, for hooking it up um, and sponsoring my dark roast and for sponsoring my dark roast for a while. I appreciate you. Oh, Sumatra. Yep. Okay. <laughs> nice and hot today. Um, if you want to support my coffee habit or become a Buy Me A Coffee member, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. I appreciate you. Thank you to everyone out there. Um, all right, guys. So interesting thing happened. I got a call about a month ago saying, uh, we understand that you spend a lot of, lot of your time on your feet. Now, do you ever get cramps or tired? You know, sore feet, sore knees, sore, yeah, sore everything. I'm like, yes, I do. You going to come over and give me a massage? They're like, no, 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 no. We we got something for you, though. And I'm like, this is going to be interesting. What you got? He's like, how about a bike? And I'm like, a bike? I don't want to ride a bike, right? He's like, no, no, no. It's an exercise bike for your shop. You can ride it in between, you know, breaks or to warm up or to get your legs going if you're going to have to play tennis later on. Uh, that's actually a pretty good idea. So a month later, the boys over at ReLife, ReLife sent me over this box. I didn't think I'd get it, but here it is. So I guess I'll have to put it together. Um, the box is actually relatively small and let's see if it's easy or hard to put it together. Um, I guess I'll put it together now. You know what this is called? Having coffee going down the hill. <laughs> All I gotta do is what? <laughs> All I got to do is stay on the bike and uh, not fall down. That's simple enough, right? So the bike was super easy to put together. Um, my knee has been bothering me lately. So this is actually super helpful for warming up my knee in the morning, along with warming up my body with this coffee. So, I mean, it took me, what, 10 minutes to put this thing together? And I'm already going. I'm watching um, my buddy Ian from uh, Essential Tennis already on my phone here when he paid me a visit with uh, Joel. And uh, look, how many calories have I already burnt here? Let's see here. Look, I burnt six calories already. 6.8, 6.9. I'm just coasting down the hill and I'm burning calories already. And I've been on here for two minutes and 40 something seconds. So, hey, I feel pretty good. Let me show you some things. So I can put my coffee right here while I coast down the hill. 
You know, when you coast down a hill, you don't have to pedal, right? You just kind of go like this and just look the part. Oh, wait, hold on. Be a little more aerodynamic. Going down the hill. Ooh, let me tuck my elbows in. Too bad they don't have the thing. I could just lean like this. Right? Right? Do I look like I'm going down a hill? See, I don't do nothing going down the hill. I'll just sit here. But if you really want to work out, right? You really want to go fast, right? I got zero tension on this. That's why I look like I'm going fast. But if you want to add a little tension, as with most bikes, there is a tension thing, right? You want to add more. You go to this red knob here, add more, take more away, right? You want to make it harder, start turning, turning. Oh, shoot, that's heavy. Turn here. Oh, man, that's heavy. Ooh, one more turn, shoot. Ooh, damn. Oh, that's too much. I got to drop it back off. Oh, okay. All right, guys. So check it out. I got the foot pads, the foot braces to hold me in so that when I decide to go like really hard, I'm staying in the bike. Seat is actually super comfortable. I haven't rode a bike in like 30 years. We got this little digital pad here to tell me what I'm doing. These are cushioned. I can put it however I want to. This is called chill mode. This is called, I'm gonna take it a little serious mode. This is like, let's go mode. All right. This is, no crap, no crap mode. <laughs> and this is just, uh, warm up the knee mode, but it's super cool. I can watch myself on YouTube. Seat adjustment for the height right here. Height adjustment for the handlebars right here. Got hookup. This comes with it. All right, super light. See how easy it is to transport because of those wheels up front. Looky, looky. Whoa, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Put it down. Bam. Super light. Cushion on the chairs because we got some springs in the butt, springs in the back. Springs underneath, right? There's padding on the chair, so I'm comfortable. Ooh. Ooh I can actually, look, I'm, I'm five minutes in already. I'm five minutes in already. And actually my knee's feeling really good. I'm probably gonna, hmm. Wow. Actually, this is a, you know what guys? The guys over at Real Life said, you should do this before you go out and play. Since, you know, warm up time is limited sometimes on the court. Warm up your knees, warm up your joints, right? Get them flowing, warm up your body. Then you're ready to play. You warm up here, right? I gotta, you know, I'm so tight after being compressed for eight to 10 hours a day. Construction again. <laughs> All right, so yeah, after being in the shop eight to 10 hours a day, it's tough. So warm up on the bike first. Guys, re, re life. Thank you guys so much for hooking it up with the bike. If you wanna learn more about re life, I'll have a link on the bottom. They not only do bikes, but they do a bunch of other machines too. Uh, I may ask for some of those other machines just to test them out, like a climber, a stair climber. Ooh, what do you think about that, guys? But bike is super simple. It's super lightweight, pretty easy to transport too if you gotta get it from one place to the next. Guys, thank you for watching. Tennis Pit.
where we put our spin on your tennis. All right, time to string, guys. Finally, a chair that I can sit and string. Going backwards. <laughs> you know, most people, they quit tennis because, you know, it's hard to find somebody to play with, right? I'm just, I just feel so lucky to have my buddy, my buddy coach Rob, that we have so much in common. You know, we're, we're both kind of follically impaired. You know, ain't that right, Coach Rob? Us follically challenged friends have to hit together. Yes, so I have Coach Rob. If you guys need a friend and you're follically impaired or are a bearded one and looking for your bearded mate, right? Check out Player Court. They have people that look like you, play like you, maybe act like you, check out their site. It's playercourt.com. Your tennis buddy can teach you how to twirl. Hopefully You'll get it someday. Hopefully better than that. We'll have to keep practicing here. <laughs>